Hey guys, my name is Mahika and welcome to Mahika's Canvas. So, uh, today we're going to make different types of marble art. So the so the thing I need uh, I'm going to tell you is marble a uh, marble had different different ways ways of uh, doing marble art. So uh, here's one way where I keep my where I keep my marbles. This is one pot, one style actually. But there are many ways of doing it, and even and even even if you just go scribbling like this, scribbling like that, it's also marble art. So uh, we don't need to worry if it doesn't come out that well. Now, uh, marble art is uh, in every drawing you do, it comes out in a unique way, and all types turn out in a unique way. So. Uh, Mishi has joined in. Arjisha has joined in. Okay, so say hi. Hi, who, uh, who Amishi. Amishi. Arjisha. Arjisha. Okay, so uh, so let's get started. Now, uh, we're going to, we're going to first take. I'm going to tell you all the things we need. Again, you need containers to put your paints, and I put one some water in the other one, and then you will take paints a tray that is like the part where you're using it needs to be lined with a uh, newspaper properly so it doesn't get dirty and and we're making three four types of marble arts we need i mean three types actually of marble arts we need three papers so um then you need some thread or wool I've taken, I've, you can even, I've taken these thread because I've already cut them out and you can even use this type thread, any type thread will work and then of course some marbles and so these, the, you need a spoon to use the, to mix and all but these are, the, you will also need them to remove the paint, you can also use the back of the spoon. So. So uh, now the first one we're going to do is our marble one, and we're going to take our. Uh, I'm doing three colors. You can do any any amount of colors you want. I mean, she's coming live. Okay. okay. So uh, here here we have the colors. And uh, I'm taking these three colors. You can take any amount of colors. And you don't need so many marbles. The first one we're doing is marble the, with the marbles. You don't need so many marbles. You uh, need only any marble. And you even need even one is okay. You can first take it in the first uh, paint and then you can take it in the second paint. So first we're going to take um, uh, since I you if you I'm using poster colors and it has a bit of like a little bit of water on the top so I'm, so yeah. so I'm going to take uh, this one a spoon you can even take a spoon Now, since I put it, we're going to take with our spoon. We're going to take some water. Mine ha already has a bit of water, so I'm gonna get take like only one spoon. Yeah, I'm only going to take one spoon because mine already had some water, I guess, on the top. Now, if you become if you all have become too watery, you can take some more paint. So first we're going, to, we're going to take our first marble and roll it in prop in our tub properly. And we're now going to this is the fun part. So we're going to take our tray with only one paper and then we're going to put our 
Eduardo. And then we're gonna roll it. How fun is this? So look at that. Now we're going to we're going to put it back in. And since you get, you've diluted water, it will go go. Uh, you'll have to do it for some time till you're tired of purple or whatever color you're picking. Okay, and now let's add the other other marbles. So we're going to take our marbles and take our other color. And this time we're going to take we're going to take golden. take some golden my golden is a bit thick so I'm gonna take some water and then I'm going to and mix it so if you're using golden uh, you have to mix it properly okay. so now, now we're going to take one marble and put it, mix it, and roll it inside as well. And now we're going to take our next marble, and you can even put them as, as many many at a time. So I'm going to take this two. Roll it and put both of them in. So now uh, we're going. Now it might it might get mixed. Both of them might get get mixed in colors, but that's fine. So we just keep. So just keep on going till you're tired of the colors and the designs and all that. Okay. So now I'm tired of blue and purple, so I'm gonna go. Hmm? Purple and gold. Yeah, so purple and gold. So I am going to take uh, my blue. My blue. And it's okay to uh, make a mess. You can always clean it afterwards. So I'm taking this type of blue. And mine has come with a little bit of water over it so okay so now again i'm going to put some uh, marbles and roll it in then i'm just going to do that here and yeah i know right so this is so pretty I feel that it so you can take good you can take so many good combinations and you can make so many of these color uh, these type things yeah and you can colorful things <laughs> and I guess I lost my speech because of such an amazing wonder okay. So now you can leave this to dry and take this water. And now you can just lift, lift up your painting, uh, the newspaper out of the tray, and leave it to dry. See this? Wow. 
somehow it's so pretty so uh, these you can make such combinations and you can even use them as wrapping paper gift wrapping paper you can even you outline them with cards you can write over this i have actually i you can even write over this and give it to someone you can even you can do lots of things with it so now now for the next thing we are going uh, you can take more colors but i have a little bit of a little of the left over of the three colors right here and now you won't need any any water or anything like that you will just need your three cups and paper and you're going to need some thread you're making a thread here uh, and i have already cut them into three three parts of uh, of paper three pieces three pieces oh, sorry three pieces of thread and we're going to just keep fix every put everything inside uh of this can you show it to me yes and just put all of it then we're going to take a thing and from one end we're going to put we're going to take it and 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 we're going to take it like that now you can make so, uh, you can make different colors so first i'm just going to let this blue in for some time to soak to create quite a bit of color huh? yeah you you might need some more color than i have made actually Uh, so I'm just gonna put a little water because mine is quite thick. Mine is quite thick, so I'm gonna take some more. Until then, let that do rest. I'm gonna put the other colors. So it's important for you to take a straight thread on like line. It's been knotted for some time. To take a straight uh. Straight thread and just soak your thread in like that. And we're going to do now the gold. Just take a cloth or a napkin and that in. So take your time in doing this because it might be a little time taking. Ah yes. Yeah. And now. I'm gonna try with the gold. So this is what it leaves. You, it, if uh, you can even get longer threads and many threads, the rainbow colors, many options. So now, take this, yeah, and then I'm going to leave that right there. So. So after some time, the paint like it's already gone into the paper. So you have to keep on taking it. And now we're going to take gold. Take some gold. Yeah, you can even try. So you have you can keep going and you should take a little more paint. Yeah, I think too. So and okay, so. This is how it turns out. You can take it. You can take many threads, and most importantly, you have to take a straight, straight thread, which 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 will help 
uh, very uh, nicely in this type of Just try with the woolen. Yeah. In, in I'm gonna not try for the people who don't have this type of thread. I'm gonna try with this full one. And we're going to okay. take more color. Yeah. I'm just gonna put this away right. So once you uh so I've I've done using this type of thread, so I'm just gonna lay it like this for some time. Then put this thread and soak it in. And just so I'm just gonna take some more blue. Because mine just got fleshed. Okay. And now we are we're going. So now, so I hope, uh, I hope you like the last one. The last one was my, the last one is one of my favorite ones. This, the this one. one. Yeah, that yeah, marble art. That was one of my favorite ones, and it's, that was also very super easy and fun. This is also that kind of one, but you need. Okay, so I'm gonna just let that rest for some time, and now we'll go on to the purple. So you can do many colors. I think the marble one is more fun. Right? Yeah. Okay. So you can keep on try. Uh, you can keep on doing this until you get bored of all the colors. Try it with the wool and see. Yeah. Now we're gonna do with the wool one. This has ob absorbed more. Yeah. Yeah. This is a nice. Absorbed more uh, color. Hello. Okay, so now, uh, so now I'm going to take the rest of all the these ones for this one also. Yeah, this the wool is very good. But mine was mine was like more a kind of paper thread, so paper soak the paint in it. Yeah. So the wool uh, will keep the paint off. Yeah, the wool will. It doesn't matter if you get your hands dirty, like look at me. <laughs> so it's all about is the fun of this type of art. So I I hope you like getting your hands mushy and all the pain and dirty. Colourful in another way. <laughs> So after this purple, uh, after you're done, we're going to move on to the next one. So you can you can even use these as many things once you let them dry. Yeah. Yeah. Here, even my hand. Look, this is also another type of art. 
So now we're gonna take, go to the next one, which, is, which you need uh, about this type of thick. It should be thick. There should be some layers. Layers to this. Now this ma of this one, you will need. You will. Uh, you will. Just, you will not need any pulling or any soaking or any rolling. You'll just need to. Yeah. You'll just need to put uh, blobs of paint can you take other color yeah so now so now i'm going to i'm going to this so, uh, i'm going to take now this time i'm going to take the sun style colors and orange okay so these are the colors i've taken and we're going to take it with uh, a stick or the back of a stick and and just pour it on looks like yeah and you just put it over here like this and spread it maybe like that on top of the newspaper so the the newspaper is not what we are coloring just remember so you don't need to spread it very thin just if just uh just the right amount Yeah. So now we're going to take. I'm going to take the orange. And this is very easy if you've run out of wrapping paper, which now maybe we don't have any wrapping gift or any paper, but uh, but you can do many things with this. Not only gift and wrap. Um, to just think in there's not uh, many things that you can do. So now, now we've taken I've taken my colors and I'm going to put my A4 sheet on top of this these colors and I'm just gonna press it with my hand like this like that different ways and look at that oh, nice. so you can do different things like the other like the last one i made of different colors i uh, drew something on top of it so maybe now you can like if i'm making like my colors you can make it a sun I mean, you can just keep on doing it on different sides of your paper. And, and everywhere. And if you want, you can take different colors and put it. This is how one. Yes, I want to put some different color on the center. Sure. Yeah. So you, I'm just going. I'm just going to put this in here, and I'm going to put more colors, maybe uh, like here or there, or even on the, in the middle. So it's all about abstract. Now we're going. I'm going to take something like that, maybe. Uh, let's see. I'm going to take green or gold. A bit of a gold. Yeah. Now we're going to take some green and put it right here. So you can then uh, you can even do the seven colors of the rainbow. That's also a possibility. You can even do the you can even you can do many colors and many combinations. The Combinations are endless. This one. So now we're going to take our paper. I'm going to take the sides and them. 
around so she is running around <laughs> it was great mahika i loved it i love the marble one the best and i'm definitely going to try it soon yeah thank you so much it was a pleasure thank you have fun bye coming Bye. Join. Uh, bye. Join me next Saturday on whatever I'm doing. Bye. I hope you like them. You can.